Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Let's talk about it, Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please hit the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. Note, all comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only, where we discuss what's going on on Google, IG. We talk about celebrity news, celebrity gossip. Today, we're talking about, in this clip, it talks about Pete Davis knew it wasn't going to work. The second source said he didn't say it for a while and Kim knew it. So it's being said that Pete knew that things weren't going to work out. So maybe he's not only in counseling, I'll say counseling first, what's being reported. Maybe he's in counseling because he knew this relationship wasn't going to work. So versus it just being pinned on Kanye, he might be saddened because he knew the relationship wasn't going to work. Now, mind you, I take it with a grain of salt in regards to what different media sources post. Some of them are allegedly working with the K's and the J's. That could be true. That could be false. I don't know. And I don't care if the K's and the J's are paying media. But that's why I said sometimes I read what's being said and I decipher and I take it with a grain of salt. Then I give my own opinion from the scams. <laughs> and allege things in regards to the court documents and regards to some of their past history of things that they've done to people. So if this is true, that Pete knew it wasn't going to work and Kim knew it too, then he might have also been in counseling regarding that. And did she fly to Australia without the kids because she was checking on him because she was sad, he was saddened. But here nor there, they're saying the day after they broke up, he was playing basketball. So for him to say he's in therapy, he might have already been in therapy because if you listen to, and I keep repeating this, if you listen to the interview he did with Charlemagne the God from a year ago, one, he talked about the tattoos, one, he talked to, two, he talked about the sadness, three, he talked about why sometimes he put the tattoos on his body, which is creepy, and then he talked about relationships, breakups, and how he feels, and then, and then, that's the one thing. He talked about from the breakup, he kind of likes it. So people can't pin that on Kanye. He kind of likes it. I don't know why. That's kind of weird. But here nor there, I think he likes the separation of that I got in it with you and I was excited, but I separated myself from you. You'd have to check out the interview with Pete Davis and Charlemagne the God. I want to say the interview was last year. Some people are trying to say that interview was this year. I think it was last year that he recorded that with him because he wasn't speaking of Kim at all because he wasn't dating Kim then. Hello? So I think it was prior to him dating Kim. I want to say it might have been maybe in the summer and then he started dating Kim, of course, nine months ago. So let me know in the comments how you feel about this article is saying Pete knew it wasn't going to work and how you feel about Kim knew it too. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. And then here you also have that he's allegedly sad, but then here she is promoting this beat collab she has. And I'll do something more on that later. But yeah, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Let me know in the comments how you feel about Kim and Pete breakup and Kim and Pete dating and whether Kanye should have got involved in all. And did she use those two for a storyline so she can be like, woe is me. Mind games, mind games. Distraction, let me know in the comments how you feel. It's always something so that way she has a storyline. So everyone be careful. If you're friends with them, be careful if you're dating. The K's and the J's like to do a lot and it's all up to you if you open that door. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. All comments are alleged. Fair use, fair use. Fair use. Have a great day, everyone.